apologise. I am not about to recite a ten minute piece on how fucked up the world is because A. I believe this would be insulting your intelligence and B. All I'd be doing about it is reciting this poem. I'm not about to give you a two minute epilogue to a thirty second piece because there's taking the piss and then there's a two minute introduction to a poem that's only thirty seconds long. I'm not about to tell you I am black, Hispanic, or my name is so unpronounceable that the kids used to pick on me at school. Because unless you have your eyes closed and your hearing aids turned to off, you should have concluded this yourselves. If not, please get your five pound refund at the door. Neither am I about to waste my time on this mic, rapping to a room full of people who know the difference between poetry and rap. I could do either, but hey, that's my point. Neither am I going to freestyle, because freestyling only seems to prove one, you didn't bring enough material, and two, you really, really want to be Vanilla Ice. <laughs> Neither am I going to put in rhyme the story of my previous failed relationships or my equally as successful sexual exploits. Funny as they may be. However, I would like to apologise because I am going to bullshit you throughout my set. Slipping in the odd white lie or ten just to get my point across. I will constantly contradict myself and rearrange sentences that otherwise in any other mundane setting would make absolutely no sense at all. I will constantly pretend to be something or someone I am not, and if the poem requires it, I will turn up dressed in a suit. Or maybe not. However, I will keep you interested. I will keep you from straying into boredom. I will make you think. I will make you gasp. I will make you pretend it's a little piece of dust in your eye and not a tear. And I will make you talk about the guy you saw at the gig with the kink cap and the Levi 501 sag so low you're not quite sure why he bothered to wear a belt. <laughs> and I will make you tell your friends you didn't realise poetry was so interesting. Poetry was so cool. Poetry was so stirring. Poetry was so now. And the next time you're going past your poetry bookstore, I will make you stop. And I will make you take a look. And then, my friends, my job will be done. Thank you. Lazy Gramophone.